the problems that you're facing, the situations that you're dealing with, the obstacles that you are moving through right now all have one thing in common. They need you to speak out of your mouth what you know God has said about those situations. So if you are facing a health challenge at this point, a health crisis, whatever have you in this moment, that situation that you're dealing with needs to hear you speaking out of your mouth what God has said about that health challenge, which is this, by Jesus stripes you were healed. If you are facing a financial lack or the possibility of lack in your life your in or inability to pay your bills or do the things that you know you need to do for yourself or your family with everything that's going on, your situation, that problem, that situation needs to hear you speaking out of your mouth what God has said about your provision, which is that my God liberally supplies and fills to the full my every need according to his riches and glory by Christ Jesus. Whatever situation you're facing, any, any dilemma, any setback, any disappointment that you are in the middle of, any mental attack, an emotional attack, an attack in your relationships or with people that you love or romantic interests, whatever have you, when you are in the middle of those situations and those situations are standing you down and staring you down in the face and sending you the message that it's not gonna change, things are not gonna get better, what you desire to see happen and achieve is not going to come to pass. You might as well give up now. In the face of that, you need to be able to look at those situations square in the face, not denying that they're there, not ignoring that they're there, not pretending that they don't exist, but you need to be able to look at them and tell those situations exactly what you know to be true, exactly what you heard God say, exactly what you've seen in your heart, exactly uh, the, the visions that God has given you about your life, about your destiny, about your purpose, about what God promised you, about your marriage, about your relationship, about your kids, about your job, about the career change that he wants you to move in, he wants you to step out and do. None, nothing that God has said or spoken to you, both in scripture or in your heart, is subject to the changing of the external world around you. The external world around you is subject to change. That is true. But what God said to you never changes. You need to stand down and stare right in the face of everything that's opposing you right now, which we all have got our fair share of things right now that are not as we would wish them to be. Some of us more than others of us, but in, you know, each person's life is different and what's extreme to one person or what's hard to one person may not be hard to you, but that does not take away from the fact that a person's experience of what they're going through is hard for them. And we're all having to deal with it. And in the face of it, I'm encouraging you to remind yourself and tell your problems what God has already said about them, because what that will do is it will accelerate your victory and getting past the opposition into the promise that God has for you. I want to leave you with this because I think it is so great. My spiritual mother said this. I have never forgotten it and I'm holding on to it. Look, listen, I'm believing. There are, there's, there's enough opposition to go around in my own life to share to two, three, four, five people myself. So I'm right there with you. It may not be as drastic or as intense or as severe as you, the situations you may be facing, but I have my own go through that I'm in the process of working through and going through. And so this statement right here that I'm going to share with you is one that I'm holding on to for my own life and that I know will be a blessing to you if you will take it. And this is the quote. This is a statement for every problem that is in your life, every challenge that you're facing or dealing with right now, every problem has a promise and a prophecy from God that went before it. Every problem has a prophecy or a promise from God that has gone before it. So every situation that you find yourself in the middle of right now, know that there is a prophecy, a promise from God that has gone ahead of that problem before the problem ever showed up and before you even knew there was going to be a problem before this storm hit, before COVID-19 hit, before all the challenges that we, you and I are all having to weather through and work through and work around and adjust and accommodate, there was a promise, a prophecy from God, both in his written word and in our hearts personally, individually, their dream, the dreams and, and desires and the aspirations that are unique and specific and tailor-made for us that God downloaded into our hearts and into our spirits way before this crisis hit the earth. 
stay with that and tell every opposing force that you're looking at right now what God said to you about that situation and about the promises that he placed in your heart.